Hello and welcome to another set of readings from Lotus Love Tarot 555. And you guys, this is your new moon reading. Um, the new moon will be um, actually today, September 28th. And I think some places may be coming in September 29th. Um, but also realize this new moon is in Libra. Libra is a sign of balance. It's the sign of scales, the scales and justice. Okay. So you're going to find, and I also know that Mercury and Venus are in, um, Libra right now. So you're going to find that it's going to be some, you know, dramatic changes and in, in people wanting to, um, make situations right. Okay. You're going to find a very, um, intense nature of love right now. And uh, we know Mercury. We all know what we hate when Mercury goes into retrograde. So Mercury is, you know, very intense planet as well. So just make sure that you are, first of all, doing the right thing, uh, making the right choices, and just behaving in a manner that you know is just pleasing um, to what the universe would want you to do. Um, I always believe what you put out is what you get back. And when you put out good, you'll get back good. Okay, and that's what you really want to focus on, especially by the new moon being in Libra, because like I said, Libra is the sign of justice. Okay, Libra, does, Libra is the sign of, you know, weighing the scales, you know, what's right as opposed to what's wrong. So if you're new to my channel, thank you for joining me. Please remember that the messages will flip-flop, so if it doesn't relate to you, it could relate to your partner. This is not a full reading. It's just a reading of giving you an idea of where you need to be setting your intentions. And if you have not ever um, set your intentions, please go to our playlist under New Moon Readings, and you'll have a 10-step instructions on how to do that. But I really want to encourage you to do that and keep up with it. You know, get a notebook and keep up with, with it so you can see how your life is changing over a period of time. Okay, don't forget to follow us on um, Instagram at Lotus Love Tarot 555 and don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Hit that little bell right there and every time I drop a reading you will be notified. Thank you for all the love. Thank you for all the comments that you continue to give. I love you guys so so much. Okay now on to your reading. Hello my Leos. Okay let's get right into your reading. Holy Spirit Divine Creator of the Universe. What messages need to be for for the sign of Leo as it relates to the new moon occurring on September 28th. 2019. What messages need to go for for the sign of Leah? Okay, I'm gonna take these three. They literally were just like hanging out, like, please take me out. Okay, Holy Spirit, Divine Creator of the Universe, what messages need to go for for the sign of Leo as it relates to the New moon occurring on September 28th, 2019. Okay. Holy Spirit, Divine Creator, the universe with messages need to go for for the sign of Leah as it relates to the new moon occurring on September. Wow. Your cards are coming out fast. When it comes out like that, that means Spirit said, I've been trying to talk to you. <laughs> Holy Spirit, divine, creator, the universe, what messages need to go for for the sign of Leah as it relates to the new moon occurring on September 28th, 2019. What messages need to go for for the sign of Leah? Oh my goodness. That one flew up in my face. Okay, last deck. Holy Spirit, the God created the universe. What messages need to go for? For the sign of Leah. As it relates to the new moon occurring on September 28th, 2019. What messages need to go for? For the sign of Leah. Oh, another two. All right. So you actually have an angel code coming through because you have three here, two, two, and one here. So that's that two. So you actually have two, 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 two. two. Okay, you have exactly ten cards. So. Engagement. Your love life is ascending to a higher level of 
commitment, okay? So some of you may be getting engaged or your, your, um, your relationship is ascending to a deeper commitment. Finances and career. This card just came out for cancers. Financial issues are a factor in your love life right now. So which means that, once again, you could be under with your bills or it could be a big focus right now on your job or your, or your finances, but they definitely are planned. Or for those of you who are actually engaged, you're probably trying to figure out how we're going to pay for this wedding. That could um, go a different, a lot of different ways. And then you've got codependency. So somebody's definitely dependent on somebody else's finances right now. Okay, they're definitely dependent on somebody else's finances. Maybe you're not working, okay, and it's kind of stressing the relationship right now and it's somebody that you're engaged to or you're living with them or your relationship is at that level of you could be engaged. Rest, you've been working hard. Take a nap and get some rest. So you need to cool out for a minute, Leo. And you need to make a decision. You're feeling stuck or indecisive. Listen to your intuition and make a decision. So you're going to have to rest. Apparently, there's some decisions that have to be made. But Spirit is telling you to rest first. Get the rest that you need. Just don't step out and making any decisions right now until you get the rest that's needed. Okay, to clear your mind out. You and your loved ones are safe and your children are watched over by angels. So don't worry about your family. Your family is good. Your children are good. Spirit is saying we're watching over them. So don't stress out about that. For those that have been worried about a son, uh, this is the one that actually flew up and hit me in my face. Your son is watched over and protected as he explores the world. World, somebody's really worried about a son, or you could be a son that your parents are really, really worried about right now. But somebody's clearly worried about a son because it's tied right into this children's car here being watched over by angels. Whatever, you might be having to make a decision about the son, uh, but I feel like this is another storyline that's coming in right now about this child. Um, in the near future, this card has come out almost in every reading. No need to worry. Like spirit is reaffirming there is no need to worry. A lot of people are worrying right now. A lot, a lot of signs are getting that card, but no need to worry. Okay, but everything's going to be um, going, you know, forth for you in the near future. You're going to see a big change in the near future. Okay. All right, my loves, if you want to do a private reading, information pertaining to that can be found below. Until next time. Bye-bye.